Bobby Fox. <laughs> it's too late to back out now. Yeah, I'm here. My oldest boy when he was uh, in eighth, eighth grade. What? Oh, God, that. <laughs> My boy, he's eighth grade, right? And I told him, you know, he don't weigh maybe 100 pounds mm-hmm. when he was eighth grade. He was a little bit of skinny shit. He has gained it a little bit since then. But, <laughs> uh, but he was a little bit of shit. But, you know, eighth grade is that cross the river, mm-hmm. cross the threshold kind of deal. And I told him we'd drive, it would work one day. And I said, listen, son. And I'd kind of got wind that there was parties going on. And, I said, listen, Jake, let me let me tell you a little story. I said, this is what's going to happen when you – you're. I know you're probably – because he lived with his mama, so I didn't have a whole lot of control over him. But I knew there was going to be a time that he was going to sneak out. And he was gonna, you're going to go to one of these parties. I said, this is what's going to happen. You're going to be the young guy at the party. So the older guys are going to start feeding you this beer. They're going to feed you this beer. Well, your 100-pound ass can handle maybe <laughs> one beer every hour and a half. And I said, maybe. I said, but you're going to drink way more than one beer. Ooh, and you're going to be miserable. And you're going to start playing quarters. You're going to play the drinking <laughs> game. And then you're going to start doing stupid shit. And everybody, you, you're, you, everybody's going to be laughing. And you think that they're all laughing with you, but they're laughing at you. Well, then the next thing that's going to happen is you're going to wind up getting sick. You're going to start puking. You're going to puke all over yourself, and if you're lucky, you don't shit over yourself. <laughs> I said, but, but that ain't even the worst part of it. You know what the worst part of all that is? He what? I said, there's going to be some fine-ass bitches at this goddamn party, and you're going to have to go to school with them fine-ass bitches <laughs> the next day, and, and they're going to look at you like, oh, there's Jake that had all the shit and puke on him. <laughs> well, I'll kiss, Kim Price. Your, I'll kiss your ass. Two days later, it's Saturday night. <laughs> and he's at my house, supposed to be at my house. Mm-hmm. I get a knock on the door. Midnight, I, don't, what the hell? I go to the door, and it's goddamn my boy Jake <laughs> sitting there on the front porch. And a lady, <laughs> or this kid, this for kid's mom, named Debbie <laughs> Weekly, and said, Clay, uh, 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 we found Jake. Uh, <laughs> he's sick. Him. He's sick. And I, I was thinking like flu sick or stomach bug because yeah. I'm still half ass asleep standing there in my underwear. And I uh, <laughs> what? And I, now I'm mad because he snuck out. Get your ass up and get in that goddamn house. <laughs> and, and then the s- reality, sh- the scope of the situation <laughs> showed because he stood up, kind of wobbled, kicked his right foot forward and flipped over backwards on his head. I go, this motherfucker really is sick. I said, all right, I, I got him, baby. I'll take care of him. So I drag old Jake in the house. Well, when I got a hold of him, everything that I had said would happen, has happened. He has got shit running down both legs, puke all over him. And Kelly, he's all yours. <laughs> she took care of his ass. That's so we That's throwed bad. him in the shower. You we had, had to watch him, him breathe. It was really? not good. Yeah. Did you have a big talk with him the next day? No, his daddy did. Did you? Did you get onto your his kids daddy for had drinking? Him out there mowing the to, yard today. Matter of fact, there's a guy that was arrested yesterday. Yesterday, wasn't it yesterday in Wichita Falls? Yeah. For a seventy-five thousand dollar bond for shooting his boy with a BB gun. I saw that. All right. Well, <laughs> the next day I had Jacob at five a.m. Er, bright and early, and I had his ass in the backyard working, and I got a porch swing. And I sit over on that port swing, and every time he slowed down, I shot him in the back with a Red Rider BB gun. <laughs> I said, dude, it ain't right. I said, yeah, let's stick out again, motherfucker. It's <laughs> <laughs> so looking like he had the mumps for a goddamn two weeks. <laughs> yeah, today they got $75,000 bond on that shit.